Hello all and welcome back to another wonderful video. Today I'm here in Bitstown. That's right, Bitstown, not Ponytown, Bitstown. Now, uh, I found another custom server. This one I found by complete chance. Um, I don't even remember how I found it. I just like stumbled across it randomly. Uh, so I'm very excited to jump into this custom server because uh, this logo looks really nice. It seems like it's going to be really good. I have not gone on there at all. Um, so I'm just going to select whatever server, I guess public server. There's only six people online, seven people online now. That's interesting. Um, but we're going to jump on here and see what we can find, what we can learn about this custom server. Maybe even get some ideas for the main Pony Town game by playing Bits Town. So uh, without further ado, let's get into this this um this like server and everything like that but before before we do if you are interested in bits town uh, i will leave a link for this server this ponytown custom server in the description and again as i say for all of these types of videos every single ponytown custom video anyway uh if you have any custom ponytown servers of your own if you know of any that i haven't tried yet please 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 do comment them below i would love to check them out and see what they're all about Alrighty, immediately I see several things that I love so much. Okay, I don't know what these things are up here in this corner. Uh, that looks like a smiley face and like a gasping face or something like that. Then you have cake over here. You have um, uh, what looks like a bit. I'm actually going to pick that up, I bet. I bet I can pick that up. I, mean, like, I bet that's like currency or something. Mm, no, it's not actually. What? What? <laughs> So, yeah, for whatever reason, I cannot pick that up. I don't I don't know why. Um, I guess that's not like a pickable upable item. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Um, but this chest here is another thing that I'm very curious of. Oh, it gave me an apple. Is this like their, their version of a fruit box? It is. Okay. Um, give me give me my banana. I want my banana. I, I want my banana, my signature banana. Okay, now, um, this looks like flags. So I assume if I pick that up, I'll have a flag. Um, this a cake, do I get like cake slices if I click this? No, it's just random cake that's just kind of, this is kind of sitting there. I really, I really like this though. Um, but here's a jelly donut. Again, I can't really seem to do anything to it. So this is all just decoration. Holy cow. Okay. I, th I was, I was about to say that the trees over here look like cotton candy. Now, now that I'm saying that there's actual lollipops. Uh, that that's definitely a hundred percent cotton candy. <laughs> this seems to be a very 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 um, candy food themed kind of well dessert themed. Let's say that a dessert themed version of Ponytown. These these uh the fence itself is just it's so perfect. I love what they did. The uh, the torches look like pocky, so that's a nice touch. Um, they actually have clovers. I actually expected them to like just not straight up not have clovers like they just remove that and Maybe replace it with something else, but no, there's there's actual clovers, which is which is interesting um, Candy cane, which I does I can't assume does anything. It doesn't yeah, it seems like it's it's mostly a candy themed uh, Version of Ponytown. Uh, I'm gonna check out the mines. Oh, what is this? Is that like I don't know what that is So the caves are completely the same. I just checked those so uh, we're just gonna skip over that and continue on uh, our journey here. Uh, let's see what else we can find. Get the barrels, the barrels are the same. Bar oh, okay, yeah, Chocolate River. Chocolate River. I, I figured there would be chocolate somewhere because in the cave the, the water texture was a little bit brown but still really blue. Oh, what is that? Oh, that's cute, it's just a floating heart. I love that, Bring, give me, <laughs> give me. <laughs> That is, that is adorable. Okay, I love what they did to the pine trees. There's a lots of like really good detail that they, they've added. They, they've changed so much about the trees and, and every single texture is so different. Uh, what the hell is this thing? This, I, I don't like this. I don't like this thing at all. Now, I get that you're doing the whole candy theme and everything like that, but please do not, do not, just, no. No, no. <laughs> get that thing out of here. I don't like that thing. Get it out of, oh god, there's more! Oh god, there's more! <laughs> You're terrifying! What the hell? Oh my god, I don't want to be near those things. We're gonna keep going on a little journey here and see what, what, what new things we can discover. There's a lot. There's a lot more flowers. I will say that. I, I imagine I can pick them up because you can in, in Ponytown, right? So can I pick those up? I cannot. I thought it could, but I can't. Okay. Oh, okay. This is, this is nice, but um, I I, I don't I don't quite I don't like the color. I don't like the color. I'm gonna be honest. I don't like the color of that. 
Awesome. Let's move on. Oh god, there's another one of those things. I don't like them. I feel like they're going to attack me. I, there's no way they would, because th there's no way that they would have went through the trouble of, like, making those things attack you. But they look like they will attack me. I don't like it. Chocolate river. Going up the chocolate river. Here's another one of those bits. Oh, I actually picked that one up. Wait, how come I couldn't pick the other one up? <laughs> That's messed up. I wonder if I can use this bit for anything, actually. I figured you would be able to, right? Because... That's kind of the whole premise of it. It's Bits Town, so... It seems pretty rare to find them. It's freaking gingerbread men. They, they scare me, man. I don't like it. <laughs> There's too many of them. It's so out of place. Like, it fits with the theme because it's all candy and everything, but it's so out of place because it's so humanoid, and, and we're, we're not humans in this game. It's just it's so unsettling to see. Their smile, their face... I don't like it. <laughs> I think it might be time to move on to the party island, see what the party island has to offer, what kind of um, nice customizations you can do there. Um, hopefully maybe find something to use these bits on because like I said, it seems like there's a place to use. Th okay, this, this is your red man are getting out of hand. I don't, I don't like that. And this actually might help me figure out what I can pick up in the game. So let's sit here for a second. Oh, you can pick up gifts, okay. You can just straight up pick an entire fence post up. I don't know what you would want to want that for, but you can pick up literally any single object. It's just it's it seems like it's doing it randomly. It's not going through any amount of them or anything like that. Um, yeah, this seems very random. I'm going to get a sign, and we're gonna go we're gonna go um, we're gonna go protest against the gingerbread man. That's what we're gonna do with these. What the hell is that thing? Can I pick that up? I don't know what that is. It's like a gumdrop or something. Um, we're gonna protest the gingerbread man. No more gingerbread men. No more gingerbread men. <laughs> They're terrifying and we don't need them. <laughs> Alright, let's go to the actual party island now and see what the actual island has to offer. And I love what they did to the house. Look at this house. This is perfect. This is so perfect. The, the detail here is amazing. Okay. I love the box of fruits because it's just this giant magical looking chest. But it's the only thing that's like that. None of the other furniture, none of the other boxes or anything like that are, are, are different like that, which is which is crazy. It's it's weird. Just oh these are <laughs> these are plants. That's what that's why they're all over the place. They're, they sw they they replace the plants with with the cake. That's why that's why it's called small plant, big plant, little plant, whatever plant. I, I love that. I love that. I, I, I can't get over it. The, these are rocks. <laughs> awesome. A giant teddy bears. Okay, then. Uh, a waffle sofa. Hell yeah. Can I get on that? I want to get on that. Hell yeah. <laughs> all right. That was all of it. Nothing else, really. So the furniture, you get giant teddy bears and waffle couches, which actually, you don't even get beds. You really don't get that that much furniture at all. Like, the, the base game actually has more furniture not necessarily fancy furniture like these rocks or these plants or or the the waffle sofas or the teddy bears or the even the chests but the it's 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 not as much as the actual game i can't i can't do anything to the teddy bears um but yeah that's that's interesting that's a that's nice that's interesting and and of course we have to test if we can go on this boat and if it will do anything if we do and it does not but yeah, it doesn't seem like there's much to do here other than what you can do in the base game. Um, it's missing some of the furniture from the base game, so I would love to see them add that. Uh, stuff like this, the, uh, the actual mattress, the, the uh, uh, some of the trees. Like, I, I imagine they, they wouldn't be like normal trees. I imagine they would be like lollipop trees like these or something. But yeah, adding trees, maybe adding these kinds of rocks or something like that. I assume they're rocks. I don't really know, to be honest. Um, give us the torches, stuff like that. Um, you know, stuff like that in the in the actual house and homes and everything. Wait, wait. Here's here's a vending machine in a, in a building. How how did I miss this? I was literally sitting right up here a minute ago. How how did I miss that? What does the what does the vending machine do? You need three to buy something. Okay, let's see what's in this building. I imagine it's like a store or something. Wait, can you just like build in here? <laughs> Um, this is where everyone is. None of them, none of them are English. Can I build in here? 
Is it possible to build in here? I'm gonna put a teddy bear somewhere. You can just build in here. What? What, what the heck? I don't I don't understand this room. I don't understand this room at all. It seems like it seems like there might be a path out to here or something. No. Why why is like the wall like missing bits and pieces of the texture? I don't I don't understand this at all. This is really 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 bizarre. This is this is really bizarre. This I don't I don't understand this at all. I I don't I don't I don't I don't understand I I I'm literally just sitting here like I I, I can't I I don't understand why is there just a house just sitting here I just what <laughs> what I I it, it lets you it, it like lets you do whatever you want to this house this I don't I don't I can't comprehend it. I don't understand what what the point of this is. This guy just kissed the wall after kissing this person over here. Um, I, they're just kissing random parts. I'm just I'm getting out of here. Um, what the hell? What? Wait, what? What the hell? I. Uh, what? I'm at the party island now. What the hell? What? Um. Okay. So, I don't I don't understand that. I don't I don't I have no clue. What just happened? I have no clue at all. Um, I'm actually starting to see people now. Uh, almost all of them are Russian, which is interesting. Um, okay, so if this is the house I went in, and it teleported me to the the party island house, um, which is interesting. I don't I don't understand that actually. See, it brought me back here. I don't. This is very bizarre. This is very very bizarre. And then back out here. There's Snow Yuk again. Yeah, Snow Yuk. This is this is really bizarre. Uh, I don't I I really don't understand that at all. I that that is so confusing to me. Now, what I do want to do is I want to get 3 bits so I can buy food to see what that's like. Okay, I went through the settings again to see if I can like change it to where I can see through obstacles and everything. And I found this weird tab called Dev, and there's like a pink thing here which I can't do anything to. Uh, and then a thing here that I can type in. So my, my question is, what does this do? Does it give me things? Um, but yeah, that's uh, another thing about this that's very peculiar. Okay, so, gonna be honest with you guys, it took way, 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 way longer to uh, get three bits than I thought it was going to take. I'm not gonna even explain how long it took, um, but it took me a really long time. Actually, as soon as I found the third one, there was a fourth one near the uh, thing it was like right over here um but uh i i finally have enough bits to buy something from the food machine now my question is what exactly is this food machine going to do uh and um what what is it do i have enough now or is it just gonna like change the prices what's gonna happen let's find out let's press it you bought a random food and spent three bits what is this thing it looks like a bug zapper what is this thing i can't even tell what this is this doesn't look like food at all. It looks like a bug sound. What the heck is this thing? What is this? This isn't what I signed up for. This isn't what I wanted when I wanted a random food. I thought it would give me like candy or something. No, it's just bug zapper. <laughs> oh God, okay. Okay. <laughs> I think we have our um, answer to what the actual machine will give me. Uh, I don't have enough to get another one. I only have one bit left. Um, so that's that's interesting. I think I want to just kind of end the video on that. Um, so just we this it seemed like a really fun place. You know, the uh, the the mechanic of like trying to find bits to like unlock new things is very nice. It's very interesting. I would love them to kind of expand on that. Maybe make it a tiny bit more easy to find bits. Um, it's kind of insane how difficult it is, especially since there's like seven people on here right now. But yeah, I just, I think it should be a little bit easier. It definitely feels like there's only one bit on the map at any given moment, um, which is insane to me because that's not, that's not good. That's not good enough. You need, you need to increase that. You need to increase that, add more things to unlock by getting X amount of bits and spinning them. Um, they need to, I think that's really the main thing they need to do because that's kind of the whole 
the the whole I'm not going to say the point of it, but that's kind of the gimmick of it. And I don't really, really don't even want to say gimmick, but that's kind of the the pull of it, the draw of it. That's one of the things that kind of brings you to Bitstown is that you want to collect, you want to collect the bits, you want to collect the um, the currency or whatever, so that you can spend it on food that may or may not be a bug zapper. Um, that's really what you want to do in Ponytown. That's really what you want to do here. So, um, not Ponytown as a, as a whole, but that's really what you want to do here. So. Yeah, I think these gingerbread men are still freaking me out. I think that's going to do it for the video. So um, uh, I do hope that you enjoyed. And if you did enjoy, please like, subscribe, share. You know, do those wonderful things. Because when you do those wonderful things, you get access to wonderful content such as this. But that's not all you get. That's not all you get. You also get to become wonderful yourself. And I think we all want that. So do those wonderful things. And until next time, stay wonderful. There's someone hiding behind here. There's, there's, there's just chilling back there.